How are we doing today? It's Jeremy Wells again. I want to thank you all for tuning in. Today's topic, we're going to talk about why CrossFit is so expensive. So I get a lot of questions throughout uh, while I'm coaching and training and new people walk into my gym, and they're going to say, hey, well, the most main question I'm going to get is, hey, how much is CrossFit or how much is this training facility that you're doing? And I'll, I'll tell them our price, and then they get those big eyebrows and they're like, whoa, I paid $12 for a facility down the street. So I, I do want to explain today, so I do kind of see maybe the confusion of what is the difference and why it is more expensive. So when you come into a CrossFit facility, one, you're going to have someone that's coaching on you on the floor an all hour. So for 60 minutes, you're going to have a, a girl or a guy or maybe sometimes multiple coaches coaching you on an Olympic movement, a gymnastic movement, a metabolic movement, running, rowing, burpees, jump rope, box jumps. If you're looking at some Olympic lifts, you're looking at snatch, cleaning, cleaning jerks. These are people that are certified to do and to be able to coach these movements. So first you're gonna have a coach. It's kind of like having a personal trainer, but not paying the price of a personal trainer. So I, I do PTs on the side um, without, you know, just one-on-ones, and you're looking about 30, sometimes $40 an hour. And I know on the West Coast, sometimes $50, $60 an hour for one-on-one. -on -one. And it's the, the same, they're gonna do the same workout. We're gonna, we're gonna coach them, we're gonna program them. So when you come into a CrossFit gym, you're asking for someone to coach you for a full hour. So of course, that's gonna show, have a little price on it right there, a little value than just $12 uh, a month. Also, you, then you can have someone programming for you. So this person has been programming um, for probably hundreds of athletes, thousands and thousands of hours of learning how to program for maybe a master's uh, training uh, facility, uh, a kid's training facility. Um, he might you know, do a lot of co-ed around 30 to 40. Those are different ways to program, scale, modify certain people. So you, that's another expertise, another experience. Someone has a lot of experience giving to, um, to you. So when you come in, now you have a coach, now you have someone programming for you. Now I know some CrossFit gyms and visiting some, you're gonna have people with sports nutritionist search or at least like a nutrition specialist on hand to answer any of your questions, to see you know, how much protein you need, how much carbs you need, what you need to eat today, what's good before a workout, what's good after a workout. So this is really like having a personal trainer but not paying $40 an hour. So if you look at um, five sessions with a personal trainer, you're looking about almost $150, $200 where a CrossFit and definitely it depends on the demographic that you're in you're looking around 75 to 125 bucks a month and the you know the south like Louisiana Mississippi area so that really breaks down to only about five to seven dollars a class that you're going to but you're getting the same thing as a person that's personal training so it's it's not that you have the mindset you might have the mindset that, oh it's expensive when you really break it down it's it's really not that expensive now look at Starbucks all right uh, I got an oatmeal there this morning. That was $3.25. You go try to get a cup of coffee um, and add stuff to it, that could end up to $7, $8. And that's a, right there, a class of CrossFit. Now you look at, um, so you got the coaching, you got the programming, we, you know, you have the nutritionist, and now you might have somebody that's gonna teach you how to do mobility, how to stretch correctly, how to, if you have, your back's tight, your shoulders need a little bit better range of motion. So now they're adding quality and functional uh, functionality to your life. So they're gonna add a few years to your life. So it's really not that expensive. It's the mindset that we have. We think, oh man, it's a hundred bucks a month to work out. It's not a hundred bucks a month to work out. It's a hundred bucks a month to have a coach, to have someone programming for you, to have someone you do nutrition, to help you with your measurements, your body fat, someone to help you learn how to squat below parallel with the hips open, your chest up. So when you're 75 years old, you still are able to do these things. It's not expensive because we're adding five, 10, 15 years of great quality life. I coach people in their 70s um, that can do amazing things, but I also know people in their 70s that can't play with their grandkids. So it's not that expensive when you really break it down. So that's kind of um, just a little quick thing of why, do you, why CrossFit is expensive. If you think it is expensive, I can promise you it is worth it. If you cut out just a little bit in the maybe the movies or the alcohol or Starbucks or all, any of these things that are just luxuries and take fitness as a priority and then your mindset will change and it won't be so much of oh it's so expensive it's worth it i promise make sure you check out a crossfit gym in your area today make sure you ring the bell i want you to leave any comments any questions anything about crossfit or why expensive i can go into a little bit more y'all have a great day i'll see y'all next week